I spent 41 years in classrooms all around the country, and I've often been asked who was my favorite teacher. And actually, my favorite teacher out of school was a, someone on the St. Louis Cardinals. Here's the backstory: I dropped out of college, was hitchhiking around the country. I was a big baseball fan, so I decided to go to spring training. Uh, you have to picture me, 18 years old, 6'2", carrying a sleeping bag and a, a travel bag. And I walk down and I come to the field and the, this ragtag bunch of players are coming off the field as I walk in. And I, I, I can't, I don't know what's going on. I look around and a guy from the St. Louis Cardinals, uh, one of the coaches, saw me and he comes over to me and he looks at me and he says, kid, I'm sorry, you're too late. I had no idea what he was talking about said, I'm sorry, you're too late. Where'd you come from? And I had hitchhiked from Kansas, uh, where I'd been working. Uh, so I, I, I said, Kansas. He said, oh my God, well. He said, what position do you play? Well, I wasn't a baseball player, but my favorite player was the third baseman for the Braves called Eddie Matthews. So I said third base. And then he looked at me and he said, you kind of look like you could hit the long ball. And I realized I had walked in on rookie tryouts and this guy thought I was a baseball player. He said, tell you what, come on back tomorrow. I'll give you, I'll give you a chance because you come here from Kansas, the least I can do is give you a chance. I said, thanks. And I wasn't about to tell him I wasn't a baseball player. I just got a kick out of it. Well, hitchhiking around the country, I would go to colleges and just fraternity and say, hey, can I get a bed for the night? So I found a local college, got a bed for the night, and sitting around with the guys, and I told them this story, how funny. This guy thought I was a baseball player. Well, isn't that funny? Um, and so the next day we went to the park. Of course, I wasn't going to go for a tryout and embarrass myself, but there was an exhibition game, Pirates and Cardinals. And we went into the, and after a while I got bored sitting there, so I went down by the Pirate dugout. I, I saw Dick Grote, one of the Pirate shortstops. I, I was a big fan. I and I told him about my being offered a tryout. He said, come tell the guys. So he takes me into the dugout. I'm sitting there with Dick Grote, Roberto Clemente, all these, and I start telling the story. Danny Murtaugh, the pirate manager, notoriously profane guy, comes walking along and he sees his players with this guy sitting there. He says, who the fuck is that? Get him out of here. Get that guy out. He doesn't look like, he doesn't even look like a ball player. Get him out of here. And so I left. And, and of course, I never went back to meet that coach who was offered me a tryout. And I, and I was mocking that he made that he thought I was a ball player. What a fool I was! That guy, that guy saw me, read me as as a, an earnest kid who wanted to make the part man, wanted to make a team, and he went out of his way to offer me a tryout. And I, for years, never even realized what a big man he was, and what a small man I was. So that guy taught me a lesson, and I never had a chance to thank him. So thank you.